ഹലോ സ്റ്റുഡൻസ് വെൽക്കം ടു മൈ യൂട്യൂബ് ചാനൽ കെ സീസ് ഇ സയൻസ് ഇൻ ദ ഫസ്റ്റ് പാർട്ട് ഓഫ് ദിസ് വീഡിയോ വി ആർ ഗോയിങ് ടു സ്റ്റഡി അബൌട്ട് ദ ഫസ്റ്റ് ചാപ്റ്റർ ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് ന്യൂട്രിഷൻ സി ലാസ്റ്റ് ഇയർ വി സ്റ്റഡീഡ് സം ഓഫ് ദ ന്യൂട്രിയൻസ് ഡു യു റിമെമ്പർ ന്യൂട്രിയൻസ് See, nutrients are the components of food. They are carbohydrate, fats, proteins, vitamins, minerals, plus fiber and water. These are the food components present in our food. These are known as the nutrients. Out of this, carbohydrate and fats are called nutrients. energy giving nutrients proteins are body building nutrients vitamins and minerals are called protective nutrients these nutrients we get from our food therefore nutrition is the process of taking food which are rich in nutrients as we mentioned earlier nutrition is the process of taking nutrients into our body and its utilization okay nutrition is the process of taking nutrients into our body and its utilization that is the definition for nutrition see there are mainly two types of nutrition one is called autotrophic nutrition and another one is called heterotrophic nutrition see the green plants which make their own food by a process called photosynthesis this nutrition is known as autotrophic nutrition and the plants are called autotrophs or producers whereas all other animals including human beings dogs goat cow all these animals are depends depend on plants for their food the, they are called heterotrophs as they are depend on plants for their food they are called heterotrophs and this kind of nutrition is called heterotrophic nutrition are you clear so there are two types of nutrition autotrophic nutrition and heterotrophic nutrition are you clear see the autotrophs prepare their food by photosynthesis but the animals you see the goat depend on the plants for their food therefore goat is an example for heterotroph okay autotrophs are green plants the plants are called autotrophs see the plants prepare food by photosynthesis by using solar energy by using carbon dioxide and water and they prepare their food see as the food is prepared in the leaves the leaves are called the food factories or kitchen of the plants okay leaves are called the kitchen or food factories and all other animals which are depend on the food prepared by plants by photosynthesis are called heterotrophs okay all the animals which are depend directly or indirectly on plants for their food are called heterotrophs now coming in detail to autotrophic nutrition see the plants we know that the leaves i already told you leaves are called the food factories why because food is prepared in the leaves by the process of photosynthesis as the plants prepare their own food plants are also known as producers okay in autotrophic nutrition the plant prepare the food known as carbohydrates the carbohydrates are prepared in the leaves okay the root absorb the water and carbon dioxide is absorbed by the leaves and they prepare their food this process is called autotrophic nutrition look at your surrounding you can see greenish plants isn't it see these green plants consist of the pigment called chlorophyll the chlorophyll trap or absorb the sunlight chlorophyll 
trap the sunlight chlorophyll is present inside the leaves inside the leaves there are molecules inside the cell see you can see lot of cells in the cell chloroplast is present chloroplast is the molecule inside that chloroplast molecule you can see the green pigment called chlorophyll so where are chlorophyll are present chlorophyll are present inside the chloroplast of leaf the chloroplast absorb the sunlight and inside the leaves you can see in between the cells there are kidney shaped cells you can see two kidney shaped cells they are called guard cells these two guard cell together form the stomata the stomata slowly open you see stomata is slowly opening so that the carbon dioxide in the atmosphere is going inside the cell see stomata opened now the carbon dioxide from the atmosphere goes to the cell where chloroplast is present okay so now carbon dioxide is taken by the chloroplast and the roots the roots of the plant absorb the water from the soil through their root hairs so the root see the root absorbing water this absorbed water slowly goes to the upper part of the leaf upper part of the plant where leaves are present see the water molecules are going up through the stem already carbon dioxide is present in the leaves now the water is absorbed by the roots and it is going and reaching the leaves okay see the chloroplast molecule trapping the sunlight okay sunlight is trapping with the energy of sunlight this carbon dioxide and water molecule combine together in presence of chloroplast to produce glucose and release oxygen this process is called photosynthesis by photosynthesis the green plant prepare the food called glucose okay and during this process photosynthesis oxygen gas is given out that oxygen gas is used for breathing of all animals and the glucose or the carbohydrate prepared is stored in different parts of the plant see carbon car, uh, this uh, carbohydrate is stored stored in the form of what starch in roots in leaves in fruits okay this food is used by us and the oxygen is given out okay this is called autotrophic nutrition hope you understood this video okay and we see the next part in the second video thank you